Hello, I'm Jim Tucci, National Sales Manager with Flomatic Valves. Uh, we're going to talk briefly about our offering of isolation valves or shutoff valves. Flomatic offers uh, two styles of gate valves, uh, resilient wedge gate valves. Uh, here we have our AWWA C509 compliant gate valve and our AWWA C515 gate valve. Our 509 offers a bronze stem attached to a resilient wedge, goes up and down just like a gate uh, infers up and down to shut off the flow of your, of your stream. Our 115 or 515 Flomatics model 115 offers a stainless steel stem down to a resilient wedge. You'll also notice some differences with our cover hardware, um, some exposed stainless steel hardware here, or some uh, zinc hardware that is covered with an epoxy um, once the bonnet is all set. Team Flomatics model 115 is offered with flat phase ANSI flanges, mechanical joint ends, or push on for irrigation pipe. Uh, Flomatics 109 is offered with flat phase flanges. Flomatic offers an eccentric plug valve, our model 54. Shown here, bare stem uh, with, with uh, no top works. This is a full ported plug valve, um, quarter turn valve, isolation valve for your wastewater applications. So your, your gray water, black water, slurries, etc. These valves are offered up to 24 inch. Um, pressure rating. Up to eight inch is 200 PSI, 10 inch and above 150 PSI by directional rating. Full ported up to eight inch size, above eight inch, reduced ported offering, 90% reduced port. This valve got a Buna coated ductile iron disc and the seat has a nickel welded overlay of 90%. This valve can be offered bare stem with a two inch operating nut, such as you see here on our gate valve, two inch operating nut, a gearbox with hand wheel for your larger valves, or we can also automate these valves. Flomatic offers as well, a class 150B butterfly valve, ductile iron body, a vulcanized Buna seat, vulcanized to the valve body, our disc is a ductile iron disc with a 316 stainless steel edge. This too, like our plug valve, uh, for easy operation on our smaller sizes, a 10 position handle. We can also use a larger gearbox with a handle for, for your larger higher torque applications, as well as your electric and pneumatic applications. Uh, just consult the factory for any of your automation needs and we can discuss them with you. So when would you choose a certain valve for a certain application? Gate valves, uh, purely that isolation valve, open or closed. Although this gate goes up and down, it's not an ideal valve for a throttling application. This can be used in your potable water applications, uh, irrigation applications, possibly some wastewater applications, but not highly recommended. Your plug valve is designed for wastewater applications. Uh, the full port design with that concentric cam of your seat, um, plus the design of the plug and your, your nickel covered seat allow for abrasive resistance for those high nasty applications. For dirty water, gray water, slurries, uh, those type of really difficult applications, that's where your plug valve comes in handy. Your butterfly valve, uh, mostly designed for clean water applications and also can be used for a throttling application. Due to the disc being in the flow path, it is not ideal for wastewater applications, but for your larger, larger size valves and depending upon the waste stream, it is possible to utilize these for, for such applications. Um, would not recommend a smaller diameter valve in a black water application, obviously, because there's potential for clogging. Um, but this valve, again, can be used for wastewater, but more so clean water applications, especially with its NSF 61 certification.